What's up guys, it's Tyler Ford. Welcome back to the video. And as you guys can see, I am in the worst possible recording environment. I'm in the war zone right now. And I'm just kidding, I edited all those sound effects on. But the audio still isn't even that good. But nevertheless, this video is about Crumple Pop, which is Boris FX's brand new audio restoration program. So I'm gonna be experimenting with it and going into different recording environments and seeing how it works and performs. So let's jump right into the video. All right guys, what's up? I'm back in my normal setup. Now, as you guys can see, I might sound a little bit different and that's because in every single one of my videos, I always edit my audio manually. I do a little bit of EQ, a little bit of noise reduction and just some basic effects like that. But nevertheless, guys, I'm gonna edit the audio using Crumble Pop. So let's see how it sounds right now. So now the audio is edited with Crumble Pop. Now, I bet it sounds pretty much amazing. I'm pretty sure it'll sound perfect because I am in a really good room that has a lot of acoustic foam and I've done a lot of good sound management here. So yeah, normally I don't have to spend too much time making my audio sound good. It pretty much always sounds good already because I got a good microphone, got a good interface, and I got a nice room setup. But nevertheless, guys, enough yapping around. Let's go check out the audio and see how it actually sounds. So let's jump right into it. All right, guys, now I'm back in the studio again. As you guys can see, I took my hoodie off because it's freaking hot as hell in my room. But nevertheless, as you can see, we got everything. Oh, I gotta hide that, actually. I just leaked my name and my email. All right, but nevertheless, I'm gonna have to censor my name and email. But this is Crumple Pop and Boris FX's little plugin manager thing. It's also a VST and it works in Premiere and Audacity and Avid as well, which I think is pretty sweet. You know, I always love audio effects that are VSTs because it just makes everything so much easier. But nevertheless, I'm using the standalone app right here because I want to show you guys more about it. So as you can see, these are all the features it has. So you can remove Mike Russell, remove pops and plosives, remove room noise, set levels automatically, remove echo, and remove wind noise. Now I didn't enable these two because the audio already sounded good and I felt like this just added a little bit more that artificial sound to it almost. So I didn't reuse those, but nevertheless, you got a lot of settings in these as well. You got the little thing, you can affect the mids, you know, <laughs> and you can also do the output and all that cool stuff stuff. Same with pops and plosives. It even gives you a nice little guide on everything. Like it'll, it'll show you what everything does and you can save presets, save the audio, all that cool stuff. Now the cool thing about this is you can import it as an audio file or a video file. And in this case, I imported it as a video file and therefore I can save it as a video file too. So I think that's pretty sweet. Now I'm not going to show you guys what every single setting does because that's a whole nother topic for another video, but I do want to show you guys it use actually out on the field. So I recorded a few examples in different rooms and in different environments environments to see how it sounds. So I'm going to play those clips and we're going to try out Crumple Pop on those and see how it sounds. All right, as you guys can see, we're back outside again. This is what the audio currently sounds like. Hopefully it doesn't sound too bad, but let's activate Crumble Pop. And this is what it sounds like right now. Hopefully it sounds pretty good. All right, guys. So now I'm inside. As you can hear, there's a little bit of echo, a little bit of reverb. Hopefully it doesn't sound too bad again. We got Dow over here. And I also got a TV on in the background over there. I don't know if the mic's picking up the TV, but let's activate Crumple Pop. This is what it sounds like right now. I bet it sounds a lot better now, at least compared to outside, but let's go move on to the next one. All right, guys, so we got a lot of echo in this room. As you can see, I'm in my bathroom. I got Dow with me here as well, and there's a lot of echo, a lot of reverb. It doesn't sound too good. Hopefully the Crumple Pop can remove it. Let's see how it sounds. I think it'll probably sound a lot better as well, but let's give it a shot and hope for the best. Well, 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 order. What do we have here? It appears that this software, not too shabby. I feel like I could have gotten better results if I tweaked the settings more, like messing with the lows and the mids. But I feel like for a plugin that's like as simple as this, it does a pretty good job for being super simple. I mean, you literally just gotta click these buttons and you can just adjust the sliders and all that cool stuff. You also got a sick little preview thingy right here. And of course, you have it as a VST. So overall, I give it a thumbs up, all right? Now I will leave a link to it down below in the description, which is an affiliate link, but as you guys already know, guys, I wanna be extra clear about this. There's not gonna be any bias, all right? If a product is trash, I'm gonna flame it. And I didn't have to flame anything yet on this video, and hopefully I don't have to flame any more products. But nevertheless, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, guys. I make videos on editing and all sorts of other cool stuff. And hey, my social media links are down below too, as well as my editing discord. So if you wanna talk, chat, and learn more tips and tricks, be sure to join that. And on a real note, guys, I've been grinding the content out. I mean, I'm finally not uploading like once every three months, which is pretty good. So hey, we might be hosting some streams soon. So hey, if you're into that, be sure to subscribe with the notifications to stay up to date for when I go live, because I'm going to be doing some contests and other cool stuff coming up. So hey, keep an eye out for it, man. Keep an eye out. But nevertheless, guys, I love y'all so much. Take care, have a good one, and I'll catch you guys in the next video, boys. Peace out, gamers. I know fame, but she know I'm